So behavioral science uh, can be defined as using behavioral and user-centered thinking and really immersing yourself in the context of a problem to understand how people behave in different environments and why. You can then use that thinking to apply it to facilitate better public policy decision making. And behavioral science draws on a broad range of different disciplines, so it's not just psychology, but also disciplines like sociology and anthropology and even philosophy. So having people apply to become teachers or having them drink less alcohol, stopping people from getting involved in knife crime or moving people back into employment, government communications has a role to play in facilitating behaviour change. Every piece of communication will in the end aim to enable behaviours, so therefore it's really important to actually understand the behaviours in the context in which they occur and thinking about how communications can contribute to enabling them. What's important is that we start expressing any object, communications objectives in the form of very concrete behaviours. Who has to do what, how and when in order for us to achieve our campaign aims? And next we can start really thinking about why the behaviour is currently not occurring. What is the context? What's people, what are people's lives like? And what are the barriers that are in the way of the behaviour? Is it that people don't know how to do something? Is it that they don't think it's a good thing to do? Or is there something in their environment that prevents them from doing it or makes it really, really hard? Behavioural science can gives us, gives us some tools to actually analyse the context, analyse these barriers in a very systematic way. Once we've understood them, you can then design communications that helps remove those barriers for people to enable the behaviours. And what's important here to note is also that communications can tell people what to do, and why to do something, communications can't overcome some of the other barriers that are in the way that are in the environment, like people not having money or not having time to do it. So behavioral science also helps us focus on the communications activity in a way that actually can help contribute to removing barriers. So unfortunately, there is no shortcut. Uh, there is no magic book. But thinking about behaviors at any stage of campaign planning is really important. And you can find out more at the Strategic Communications a Behavioural Approach document that tells you about how to apply behavioural science at any stage of OASIS. Mm -hmm.